Hi, I'm Andre, and me and my friend Ricardo are making a paragliding game you might have seen in one of our other videos. And I've played a few paragliding games before, and one problem they always have is how do you control your paraglider? Because in the real world, you pull a line and you can pull more or less, and it's a very tactile, very analog thing. Uh, but playing it with a mouse or with a keyboard is not really great. So I thought, why don't I make my own controller? I can use one of these uh, sliding potentiometers like you find in audio equipment as my input. And I can use one of these tiny, tiny little uh, Arduino Pro Micros because they can connect directly to your computer via USB and act like a game controller. So the first thing was to go on eBay and find the cheapest sliders I could find. So for that I bought a faulty sound mixer that has lots of little sliders and knobs and buttons. So I got one of those and... So after that I ended up with uh, all these pieces and I modelled them in CAD. So with an accurate model of all these sliders and buttons I can build a case around it. So with the case designed, I asked my friend Dave to 3D print me a uh, test piece of the top plate. So now I can mount all the components, uh, make sure they all fit correctly before I print the real thing. And also it will help me 
make all the connections and make sure it works. So uh, that seems to work pretty well, better than expected actually, so let's print the real one, put it all together, have some fun!
So it's uh, working really well. That's awesome. At the moment, only the brakes are connected, but in the future, these can do anything. So you could have speed bar, uh, big ears, left and right, look up, look down, and look left and right, and reserve. As far as I know, it should work with all paragliding games if they support a game controller. And in fact, it should work with any game, even if it's not with paragliding. So even if you want to, you can even make music or anything where you want an analog input into your computer. This can work as a game controller or a MIDI pad or anything. The only difference is two lines of code that you upload to the Arduino and it starts working as whatever you want it to be. If you enjoy these videos and you want to help me make more, please consider supporting me on Patreon. And if you want to build your own controller, these are pretty simple to put together. And I'm going to put the CAD files on Patreon so you can download it and print it yourself and build yourself one of these. And if you don't want to make your own controller, I'm thinking of maybe making these available to buy by the time the game comes out which we're not really sure when it is yet. But if you're interested in that, let me know in the comments and I'll think about it a bit more, see how we could make this available to more people. But that's it really. Thank you for watching as always. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.